Hi guys and welcome back to our Mauritius vlog. Quick recap for anyone who's new here. Harsh and I planned a trip for our siblings Priyal and Pranav and took them with us to Mauritius on vacation and this is part 2 of that holiday. Before we proceed any further, just make sure you hit the subscribe button and let's go. plan for the day was to try out a few water activities but that's pushed forward because the weather is kind of cloudy and there are high possibilities of it raining so for safety reasons we have changed that plan instead of that we'll be exploring the city side and see the local culture over here by the way guys meet Darshini and Ram they've been taking us around this beautiful country Mauritius thank you <laughs> thank you so much thank you. Um, I've been to Mauritius <laughs> it's official so today we'll be checking out of our hotel and moving to a new resort called Anantara Eco in the south of the island. Before we head there, we'll be touring a sugar factory here. Mauritius is one of the world's leading exporters of sugarcane and we'll be seeing how it's made at this factory. We also got to do a sugar tasting and it was so yummy to try these different flavors. Sugary? Sugary. <laughs> After the sugar factory, we made our way to the citadel, also known as Fort Adelaide. This fort was strategically built to overlook the entire city. On one side is the commercial end, on the other side is the residential part, and behind me is the harbour. So they could overlook everything at one point itself. What you see over there is the second oldest race course in the world. The first one's in England. We have made it to the waterfront and we're just finding out that a lot of movies have been shot over here. Like the hotel right behind me, that's where Garam Masala was shot apparently. Welcome to Anantara Eco. This is going to be our home for the next three days. This resort is built right on the beach and we got some beautiful adjoining rooms with a view of the ocean. We're very excited about staying at this hotel because they have a bunch of activities and things to do. First, we'll start with the rum tasting at the bar. None of us really like rum, but who can say no to free alcohol? On a scale of 1 to 10, how tipsy are you? Not that much, actually. No? <laughs> a little bit, yeah. And Pranav? What? Sorry, I didn't say anything. 6? Six. Six? Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, how tipsy are you? Not at all. What are you saying? <laughs> oh. <laughs> 12 seconds later we want, we want the instructions please you, you hold them you hold them no, like like this you hold the opposite hand no, like like this Aise, and Achha. then you okay okay Aise. yeah and then you pull, pull up. <laughs> a few moments ago what are you saying oh. Today we've picked up some cycles from the resort and we are going off-roading. The cycling itself was hella tiring, but the views along the way more than made up for the sweat we lost. We have only done like 2% of the entire trail and we have already come to this beautiful point where you can see so many colors of blue, so many shades of blue. And Prachi kind of matching with the ocean here, with the blue shorts. <laughs> It's a spectacular thing. So, our guide and our brother have been gone. We were in the beach because we were not going to cycle with me. And now we are on the whole trail. Adventurous living is what I call it. But we should go further. Yes. I mean, it all leads to some place. We 
we have been doing back to back activities the last couple of days but just missed out on one of our favorite activities and that's snorkeling so we are going to go do that right now The water was turquoise blue, so very clear, just so beautiful. Well, today is the seventh and last full day of our trip, so we're heading to Illo Sur for a beach day. It's one of the star attractions of Mauritius with its luscious beaches and coral reefs. We've signed up to do a bunch of fun things like parasailing, tube ride, and underwater sea walk. Let's see how it goes. trail for a while now but we have no idea what is at the end of it like we don't know what to expect at all so we're just hoping hoping there's some good views at the end of this All of these activities and the stay at the resort and the meals and everything were included in the package we booked by Pick Your Trail so you can definitely consider them for your next holiday. Thank you so much for joining us along on these adventures. We had the best time in Mauritius. It was such a fun little island so close to India. You should definitely think about it for your next vacation. And let us know if you have any questions about planning a trip to this country and we'd be happy to answer them in the comment section. See you next time.